So the, the really great thing about this game is that it is all about multidisciplinary learning. Whether you're a doctor of any grade, whether you're a nurse of any band, whether you're clinical or non-clinical, whether you're site managers, everybody can get something different from this game and it just depends on how you tailor it. It's a safe learning environment to test your skills on practicing running a shop floor, practicing being the nurse in charge or the consultant in charge of the department and developing those senior decision making skills. It also concentrates on something that the Royal College of Emergency Medicine haven't yet tackled which is teaching about corridor medicine and over crowded management and that is something that is very key to our everyday working lives in the emergency department that we all haven't quite got right yet and this therefore helps you make uh, decisions safely test different strategies out and learn from each other most importantly you can practice a major incident whilst playing the game which makes things really heat up and get quite stressful but really good fun uh, so one of the things that I really love about the floor is that I think it really embodies a lot of the principles of good simulation and debrief, uh, particularly the fact that it's so fun, it's such a safe learning environment, uh, and that we really do get to um, have some quite deep debrief, really. I think it really does effectively simulate a lot of the stress and sometimes the anxiety that we experience uh, when trying to run a busy emergency department. Uh, for example, I find that using a bit of advocacy with, with inquiry really allows us to, to take a real interest and probe into why people make some of the decisions they do under pressure um, and particularly relate that back to real life experiences but also really validate and, and acknowledge the, the challenges and stresses that people are feeling. Uh, one of the things that I find works really well in, in the debrief as well is just helping us to facilitate uh, and acknowledge some of the team working that we have together. Um, I often think that as an A&E registrar I get interrupted a lot at work, but when you're playing the role of the charge nurse here you really realise actually they get interrupted far more than we do. Um, and I think that just understanding we're all in this together and, and really doing the best we can for our patients um, is a really, really valuable learning tool.